A cookbook or cookery book is a kitchen reference containing recipes. Cookbooks may be general, or may specialize in a particular cuisine or category of food. Recipes in cookbooks are organized in various ways, by course appetizer, first course, main course, dessert, by main ingredient, by cooking technique, alphabetically, by region or country, and so on. They may include illustrations of finished dishes and preparation steps, discussions of cooking techniques, advice on kitchen equipment, ingredients, and substitutions, historical and cultural notes, and so on. Cookbooks may be written by individual authors, who may be chefs, cooking teachers, or other food writers, they may be written by collectives, or they may be anonymous. They may be addressed to home cooks, to professional restaurant cooks, to institutional cooks, or to more specialized audiences. Some cookbooks are didactic, with detailed recipes addressed to beginners or people learning to cook particular dishes or cuisines, others are simple aid memoirs, which may document the composition of a dish or even precise measurements, but not detailed techniques. History Early works. Ancient Mesopotamian recipes have been found on three Akkadian tablets, dating to about 1700 BC. The earliest collection of recipes that has survived in Europe is De Recoquinaria, written in Latin. An early version was first compiled sometime in the 1st century and has often been attributed to the Roman gourmet Marcus Gavius Apicius, though this has been cast in doubt by modern research. An Apicius came to designate a book of recipes. The current text appears to have been compiled in the late 4th or early 5th century. The first print edition is from 1483. It records a mix of ancient Greek and Roman cuisine, but with few details on preparation and cooking. An abbreviated epitome entitled Apici Excerpta Vinidario, a pocket Apicius, by Vinidarius, an illustrious man, was made in the Carolingian era. In spite of its late date, it represents the last manifestation of the cuisine of antiquity. The earliest cookbooks known in Arabic are those of al warik an early 10th century compendium of recipes from the 9th and 10th centuries, and al Baghdadi. 13th century. Chinese recipe books are known from the Tang dynasty, but most were lost. One of the earliest surviving Chinese language cookbooks is Hu Sui's Yinchen Zheng Yao, Important Principles of Food and Drink, believed to be from 1330. Hu Sui, Bayantu Khan's dietitian and therapist, recorded a Chinese inflected Central Asian cuisine as eaten by the Yuan court. His recipes were adapted from foods eaten all over the Mongol Empire. Yumsik Demibang, written around 1670, is the oldest Korean cookbook and the first cookbook written by a woman in East Asia. After a long interval, the first recipe books to be compiled in Europe since late antiquity started to appear in the late 13th century. About a hundred are known to have survived, some fragmentary, from the age before printing. The earliest genuinely medieval recipes have been found in a Danish manuscript dating from around 1300, which in turn are copies of older texts that date back to the early 13th century or perhaps earlier. Low and high German manuscripts are among the most numerous. Among them is Das Buch von Guter Spies, the Book of Good Food, written c. 1350 in Würzburg and Küchenmeisterei. Kitchen Mastery, the first printed German cookbook from 1485. Two French collections are probably the most famous, Le Viandier, the Provisioner, was compiled in the late 14th century by Guillaume Turel, master chef for two French kings, and Le Ménagier de Paris, the Householder of Paris, a household book written by an anonymous middle-class Parisian in the 1390s. Du Fait de Cuisine is another medieval French cookbook, written in 1420. From southern Europe there is the 14th century Valencian manuscript Libra de Cent Sovi 1324, the Catalan Libra de Totes Manaris de Patechas de Menjar, the book of all recipes of dishes, and several Italian collections, notably the Venetian mid-14th century Libro per Cuoco, with its 135 recipes alphabetically arranged. The printed De Honesta Voluptat et Valitudin, on honorable pleasure first published in 1475, is one of the first cookbooks based on Renaissance ideals, and, though it is as much a series of moral essays as a cookbook, has been described as the anthology that closed the book on medieval Italian cooking. Medieval English cookbooks include the form of Curie and Utilis Cochinario, both written in the 14th century. 
The Form of Kuri is a cookbook authored by the chefs of Richard II. Utilis Cocinario is a similar cookbook though written by an unknown author. Recipes originating in England also include the earliest recorded recipe for ravioli 1390s. Topic: <laughs> Modern cookbooks. With the advent of the printing press in the 16th and 17th centuries, numerous books were written on how to manage households and prepare food. In Holland and England competition grew between the noble families as to who could prepare the most lavish banquet. By the 1660s, cookery had progressed to an art form and good cooks were in demand. Many of them published their own books detailing their recipes in competition with their rivals. Many of these books have now been translated and are available online. By the 19th century, the Victorian preoccupation for domestic respectability brought about the emergence of cookery writing in its modern form. In 1796, the first known American cookbook titled, American Cookery, written by Amelia Simmons, was published in Hartford, Connecticut. Until then, the cookbooks printed and used in the Thirteen Colonies were British. The first modern cookery writer and compiler of recipes for the home was Eliza Acton. Her pioneering cookbook, Modern Cookery for Private Families, 1845, was aimed at the domestic reader rather than the professional cook or chef. This was an immensely influential book, and it established the format for modern writing about cookery. The publication introduced the now universal practice of listing the ingredients and suggested cooking times with each recipe. It included the first recipe for Brussels sprouts. Contemporary chef Delia Smith is quoted as having called Acton, the best writer of recipes in the English language. Modern cookery long survived her, remaining in print until 1914 and available more recently in facsimile reprint. Acton's work was an important influence on Isabella Beaton, who published Mrs. Beaton's Book of Household Management in 24 monthly parts between 1857 and 1861. The book was a guide to running a Victorian household, with advice on fashion, child care, animal husbandry, poisons, the management of servants, science, religion, and industrialism. Despite its title, most of the text consisted of recipes, such that another popular name for the volume is Mrs. Beaton's Cookbook. Most of the recipes were illustrated with colored engravings, and it was the first book to show recipes in a format that is still used today. Many of the recipes were plagiarized from earlier writers, including Acton. In 1885 the Virginia Cookery Book was published by Mary Stuart Smith. In 1896 the American cook Fanny Farmer 1857 published the Boston Cooking School Cookbook which contained some 1,849 recipes. <laughs> Types of cookbooks Cookbooks that serve as basic kitchen references sometimes known as kitchen bibles began to appear in the early modern period. They provided not just recipes but overall instruction for both kitchen technique and household management. Such books were written primarily for housewives and occasionally domestic servants as opposed to professional cooks, and at times books such as The Joy of Cooking USA, La Bonne Cuisine de Madame E. Saint-Ange France, The Art of Cookery UK, USA, Il Cucchiaio d'Argento Italy, and A Gift to Young Housewives Russia have served as references of record for national cuisines. Cookbook also tells stories of the writers themselves and reflect upon the era in which they are written. They often reveal notions of social, political, environmental or economic contexts. For example, during the era of industrialization, convenience foods were brought into many households and were integrated and present in cookbooks written in this time. Related to this class are instructional cookbooks, which combine recipes with in-depth, step-by-step recipes to teach beginning cooks basic concepts and techniques. In vernacular literature, people may collect traditional recipes in family cookbooks. While Western cookbooks usually group recipes for main courses by the main ingredient of the dishes, Japanese cookbooks usually group them by cooking techniques e.g., fried foods, steamed foods, and grilled foods. Both styles of cookbook have additional recipe groupings such as soups or sweets. <laughs> International and ethnic 
International and ethnic cookbooks fall into two categories, the kitchen references of other cultures, translated into other languages, and books translating the recipes of another culture into the languages, techniques, and ingredients of a new audience. The latter style often doubles as a sort of culinary travelogue, giving background and context to a recipe that the first type of book would assume its audience is already familiar with. Popular Puerto Rican cookbook, Cocina Criola, written by Carmen Aboy Valdejuli, includes recipes that are typically of traditional Puerto Rican cuisine such as mofongo and pasteles. Valdejuli's cookbook was not only important to Puerto Ricans, but also very popular in the United States where her original cookbook has since been published in several editions, including English versions. These include The Art of Caribbean Cookery, Doubleday, 1957, Puerto Rican Cookery, Pelican Publishing, 1983, and, Juntos en la Cocina co-authored with her husband, Luis F. Valdejuli Pelican Publishing, 1986. <laughs> <laughs> Professional cookbooks Professional cookbooks are designed for the use of working chefs and culinary students and sometimes double as textbooks for culinary schools. Such books deal not only in recipes and techniques, but often service and kitchen workflow matters. Many such books deal in substantially larger quantities than home cookbooks, such as making sauces by the leader or preparing dishes for large numbers of people in a catering setting. While the most famous of such books today are books like Le Guide Culinaire by Escoffier or The Professional Chef by the Culinary Institute of America, such books go at least back to medieval times, represented then by works such as Talevant's Viandier and Chicurte D'Amico's Du Fête de Cuisine. <laughs> Single subject Single-subject books, usually dealing with a specific ingredient, technique, class of dishes or target group e.g. for kids, are quite common as well. Jack Monroe for example features low-budget recipes. Some imprints such as Chronicle Books have specialized in this sort of book, with books on dishes like curries, pizza, and simplified ethnic food. Popular subjects for narrow-subject books on technique include grilling, barbecue, baking, outdoor cooking, and even recipe cloning recipe cloning is copying commercial recipes where the original is a trade secret. Community Community cookbooks also known as compiled, regional, charitable, and fundraising cookbooks are a unique genre of culinary literature. Community cookbooks focus on home cooking, often documenting regional, ethnic, family, and societal traditions, as well as local history. Sandra Gottlieb, for example, wrote her cookbooks on Canadian food culture by visiting people and homes by region. She gathered recipes, observed the foodways, observed the people and their traditions of each region by being in their own homes. Gottlieb did this so that she could put together a comprehensive cookbook based on the communities and individuals that make up Canada. Gooseberry Patch has been publishing community style cookbooks since 1992 and built their brand on this community. <laughs> <laughs> Chefs Cookbooks can also document the food of a specific chef, particularly in conjunction with a cooking show or restaurant. Many of these books, particularly those written by or for a well-established cook with a long-running TV show or popular restaurant, become part of extended series of books that can be released over the course of many years. Popular chef authors throughout history include people such as Delia Smith, Julia Child, James Beard, Nigella Lawson, Edouard de Pomian, Jeff Smith, Emeril Lagasse, Claudia Rodin, Madher Jaffrey, Katsuyo Kobayashi, and possibly even Apicius, the semi-pseudonymous author of the Roman cookbook De Recoquinaria, who shared a name with at least one other famous food figure of the ancient world. Famous cookbooks Famous cookbooks from the past, in chronological order, include De Re Coquinaria The Art of Cooking Late 4th, Early 5th Century by Apicius Kitab al-Tabak The Book of Dishes 10th Century by Ibn Sayyar al-Warik Kitab al-Tabak The Book of Dishes 1226 by Muhammad bin Hassan al-Baghdadi 
Liber de Cacina the Book of Cookery, late 13th, early 14th century, by two unknown authors from France and Italy. Form of Curry, 14th century, by the master cooks of King Richard II of England. Viandier, 14th century, by Guillaume Turl alias Talavant. De Honesta Voluptit et Valitudin 1475 by Bartolomeo Platina, the first cookbook printed in a native language Italian in 1487 Cookbook of Infanta Maria of Portugal c. 1565 the oldest extant Portuguese cookbook The Good Huswife's Jewel 1585 by Thomas Dawson The English Huswife 1615 by Gervis Markham Arte de Cocina, Pastelaria, Biscocheria e Conserveria by Francisco Martinez Montiño, Palace Cook of King Philip II of Spain 1680. The Closet of the Eminently Learned Sir Kenelme Digby Knight opened by Kenelm Digby 1669. Yumsik de Mibang 1670 by Zhang Gai Hyang of Andong Zhang Clan Arte de Cozina by Domingos Rodriguez, the first cookbook printed in Portuguese 1680. Compendium Ferculorum, Albo Zebrini Petra by Stanislaw Czernetsky, first cookbook in Polish 1682. The Complete Housewife first American edition 1742 by Eliza Smith The Art of Cookery, Made Plain and Easy 1747 by Hannah Glass Gelpreda i Huschalingen für Unge Fruntimber 1755 by Kajsa Warg The Experienced English Housekeeper 1769 by Elizabeth Rafal American Cookery 1796 by Amelia Simmons A New System of Domestic Cookery 1806 by Maria Eliza Rundle Le Cuisinier Royal 1817 by André Viard Modern Cookery for Private Families 1845 by Eliza Acton El Cocinero Puerto, Riqueño 1859 author unknown Mrs. Beaton's Book of Household Management 1861 by Mrs. Beaton Podorok Molodim Hozaikum A Gift to Young Housewives First Russian Edition 1861 by Elena Molikovets Domestic Cook Book, containing a careful selection of useful receipts for the kitchen 1866 by Melinda Russell, first known cookbook by an African-American woman La Scienza in Cucina e l'Arte di Manjar Bene 1891 by Pellegrino Artusi The Epicurean 1894 by Charles Ranhofer the Boston Cooking School Cookbook 1896 by Fanny Merritt Farmer The Settlement Cookbook 1901 and 34 subsequent editions by Lizzie Black Kander The Cook's Decameron, A Study in Taste, containing over 200 recipes for Italian dishes 1901 by Mrs. W. G. Waters Various cookbooks between 1903 and 1934 by Auguste Escoffier Edmonds Cookery Book 1908 by T. J. Edmonds Limited. The Joy of Cooking 1931 by Irma Rombauer. Larousse Gastronomy 1938. Niga o Vikusnoj i Zadorovoy Peace The Book of Tasty and Healthy Food First Soviet Edition 1939 by the Institute of Nutrition, USSR. O Livro de Pantagruel First Edition 1946 by Bertha Rosa Limpo. A Book of Mediterranean Food 1950 by Elizabeth David Il Cucchiaio d'Argento The Alice B. Toklas Cookbook 1954 by Alice B. Toklas Cooking with the Chinese Flavor 1956 and subsequent books by Lin Suifeng Mrs. Lin Yutang Mrs. Balbir Singh's Indian Cookery 1961 by Mrs. Balbir Singh Mastering the Art of French Cooking 1961 by Julia Child Helen Gurley Brown's Single Girls Cookbook 1969 by Helen Gurley Brown The Fanny and Johnny Craddock Cookery Program 1970 by Fanny and Johnny Craddock Diet for a Small Planet 1971 by Francis Moore Lappe The Complete International Jewish Cookbook 1976 by Evelyn Rose Moosewood Cookbook 1978 by Molly Katzen Australian Women's Weekly Children's Birthday Cake Book 1980 by Marianne Blacker and Pamela Clark Topic Collections and Collectors Several libraries have extensive collections of cookbooks 
Harvard's Schlesinger Library on the History of Women in America has a collection of 20,000 cookbooks and other books on food, including the earliest American cookbook, and the personal collections and papers of Julia Child, M.F.K. Fisher, and the authors of The Joy of Cooking. New York University's Fales Library includes a food and cookery collection of over 15,000 books, including the personal libraries of James Beard, Cecily Brownstone, and Dahlia Carmel. The Brotherton Library at University of Leeds holds a designated cookery collection of over 8,000 books and 75 manuscripts, including the personal collections of Blanche Lee, John Preston, and Michael Bateman. Some individuals are notable for their collections of cookbooks, or their scholarly interest therein. Elizabeth Robbins Pennell, an American critic in London from the 1880s, was an early writer on the subject, and has recently been called, one of the most well known cookbook collectors in the world. Much of her collection eventually went to the Rare Book and Special Collections Division at the Library of Congress. Held alongside hers are the thousands of gastronomic volumes donated by food chemist Catherine Bidding. Their collections were evaluated in tandem in Two Loaf Givers, by one of the LOC's curators. A digital version is available. <laughs> Usage outside the world of food The term cookbook is sometimes used metaphorically to refer to any book containing a straightforward set of already tried and tested recipes or instructions for a specific field or activity, presented in detail so that the users who are not necessarily expert in the field can produce workable results. Examples include a set of circuit designs in electronics, a book of magic spells, or the anarchist cookbook, a set of instructions on destruction and living outside the law. O'Reilly Media publishes a series of books about computer programming named the Cookbook Series, and each of these books contain hundreds of ready-to-use, cut-and-paste examples to solve a specific problem in a single programming language. See also <laughs> Notes <laughs>